Hello, my name is Rich Howard, owner of Architectural Builder Supply, and this video is to bring you a closer look at the Ives number MB2 USP. This is a uh, this is their MB2 mounting bracket. This is going to be used. It's an unusual piece of hardware uh, when you look at it if you're not familiar with where it's exactly going to go, but it's incredibly common and absolutely necessary in scenarios, and it's very common where you have a pair of doors, and on that pair of doors is a coordinator that basically allows one door to close before the other. Uh, very typical that you'll see in pairs of hollow metal doors where you have uh, an astragal application uh, uh, where you've got to have the inactive door close first so that those automatic flush bolts lock in place, and then the active door will co close and latch everything together. Well, if you've got that COR, COR coordinator from Ives to do that, and obviously uh, parallel arm bracket style mounted door closers, uh, you can't take your parallel arm bracket and screw that through your coordinator. You need something where the coordinator can run through it, and then you can attach your parallel arm bracket down below. Now, the MB2 is for stop widths up to two and a half inch. So, a typical five and three quarter hollow metal frame uh, that has a one in nine six uh, one in uh, fifteen sixteenths rabbit on the big side for the door and then a one in nine sixteenths rabbit for the other side is going to allow a stop width of two and a quarter inch okay so that for for most common unequal rabbit um, Frames, which is industry, which is more more common than equal rabbit, uh, five and three quarter jam depth. The MB2 is the one to go with. Okay, we have some bolts that are going to be included for helping you get that installed. So it's a very crucial piece of hardware to have installed um, when you're using a coordinator and obviously any sort of uh, hardware that requires uh, or would otherwise conflict with that. A note uh, in the, it's mentioned at least once, if not twice, there are two links below this video, one to the installation instructions, the other to the product brochure. The installation instructions refer to the mounting bracket on page two. Uh, mounting brackets for stop applied hardware may be supplied with the coordinator. They generally aren't, meaning they don't come with it. You have to specify them. Brackets must be field prepared for stop applied hardware. Meaning anything you're going to do to this, you need to do to this. Drilling, tapping, etc. Lower mounting holes for door applied hardware. 15 16 to, cl to clear coordinator and the mounting bracket. So they're giving you the dimension to, a, to um, allow you to shift your templating down when you are using the MB2 as it's shown here, you know, the profile of your frame is going to sit in here like this. Okay. And that's important to know. You've got a door closer. You've got a full glass window. You're going to go with the minimum sort of top rail. Keep in mind, this is kicking down almost an inch. So keep all that uh, in mind. Uh, do not drill the holes in the coordinator at all. Don't do anything over in this area where the coordinator will, will reside. Now, the product brochure is handy. It's a tear sheet right out of the catalog um, and incorporates all the same information. Uh, it is handy because it will give you the part number of its sister products, namely the MB1, which is for stop widths greater than two and a half inch, which you're probably going to bump into in frames that are bigger than five and three quarter jam depth. And then the fire, fire mounting, uh, the fire rated version of the mounting brackets are there as well. This is available in USP, which is prime coat finish, uh, aluminum, and then black finish as well. I believe it's black. Dimensional properties. Four inch is what they have the width at. That is indeed the case. Total depth, three and a quarter. Overall height, about an inch and five eighths. Yep. That would make sense that that first giddy up would be one inch because you can have a five eighths uh, 
projection on your stop, which is industry standard, and over here you're about 5 sixteenths of an inch. Get an idea of where those screw holes lay out by studying where the tape measure falls. Okay. And this is an aluminum base material and therefore not appropriate for use on fire rated applications. So keep that in mind. The name Ives is synonymous with all things trim and auxiliary hardware related. There is a link also below this video to the manufacturer's page where you can pull up the full line Ives product catalog and review all things trim and auxiliary from a name that is synonymous with that product line. If you have any questions on the Ives, this is their MB2 and a USP finish, mounting uh, coordinator, mounting bracket, uh, not a mounting bracket for the coordinator, it's a mounting bracket for other hardware used with the coordinator or any other Ives product, please feel free to reach out to us. Thank you.